Every Cisco router ships with a default serial link bandwidth of that of a T1, which is 1.544 megabits. This has nothing to do with how data will be traveling across your link. Bandwidth is just a metric that is used by some dynamic routing protocols to determine the best path to take when we have multiple paths at our disposal. So if we want to set bandwidth and use it as one of our composite metrics for some of the different types of dynamic routing protocols that use it as a composite metric such as IGRP or EIGRP or OSPF, then we can set the bandwidth on our serial link and if that bandwidth falls into the criteria that we have set for the variable for the metric of that particular dynamic routing protocol, it'll look at it and say, well, this is a better route because of its bandwidth than the other routes that have another setting for their bandwidth. All right, all we have to do is type in bandwidth. Space question mark. And that brings it up and it lets me know that I have between one and one million in kilobits to work with for setting the bandwidth. Now, all I have to type in is the first two numbers and it automatically looks at it as being 64,000. Hit enter, and it took it. So it lets me know that now I have a bandwidth configured on my serial zero as 64,000 kilobits. So now if I have a dynamic routing protocol that is configured to use bandwidth as one of its composite metrics, it'll look at this, and if it has the better metric, it'll take this path as opposed to someone or another serial that has a different metric that is lower in value.